Okay, so to solve this equation, the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to add the square root of 3 to both sides. And then I'm going to divide both sides by 2. So then I'm left with the sine of x is the square root of 3 over 2. Now, we're going to find the solutions between 0 and 2 pi. So if you look on your unit circle, the sine of pi over 3 gives us the square root of 3 over 2. And also the sine of 2 pi over 3 also gives us a solution. Okay. Now to make a general formula that represent all the solutions, all I need to do is to add... 2 pi in to both of these. n is an integer. And there's the general formula for all the solutions.